So I'm super excited for this. I ordered this about a month ago from Amazon and it just shipped in from Japan. Um, I had a little trouble getting it because I just moved. So they they were gonna forward it to me, but I was able to get it from the post office and I was so excited that I couldn't wait. Um, I decided to open it in my car and find a location that I can just kind of take some pictures and do a, a quick review on it. So here's the actual unboxing. Um, and I love the fact that it came from Japan and it's actually got Japanese newspaper and I just, I don't know, I just think it's fun. So anyways, here's the package and it was wrapped up really nicely and, and um, protected in, in plastic. So the box stayed really pristine. Um, and not that it matters for me because I'm just gonna pop it open. But yeah, here's the um, here's the the horse in the package. It's got a nice window, of course, so you can see it clearly. And I just I saw this in a couple of pictures, and I just I had to have it because I just thought the creativity with it and the ideas and the concepts that you can use something like this are just they're so extensive. So here's the horse actually unboxed and I just think it looks really really good um, I love the fact that it comes with the stirrups and it also comes with the stand and we'll talk about that in a minute as we actually get the, the horse out and kind of start to mess with it but um, I just think it looks really clean and really really nice um, here it is and fully unboxed of course and I think the articulation is really, really nice. Like I said, it looks really clean. Um, the joints, the Figma joints look nice on this. Um, you know, I haven't looked in many other horses that, that would fit with like the six inch figures, but I really like that this fits well with Fig Figma figures. Um, the articulation, of course, is just as good as with Figma figures. Um, yeah, the, the knee bends, the, 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 um, the hooves are, were a little bit stiff on mine after I, I kind of messed with it for a while and I loosened it up a little bit, but I love the articulation, like I said. Um, the legs do go really far out, and they go, obviously, they bend and go forwards and backwards really well. Um, of course, the back legs do the same, and they come out, they go back, they go forwards, they bend really well at the, 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 um, the knee, and of course they have the hoof as well. And then um, the tail, the tail can go up and down, it can totally swivel, and it can turn, and I, I just really just like the look. I love the fact that the reins on his mouth is kind of, it's like a cloth, kind of a leathery cloth piece, um, you know, kind of in addition to the plastic that's already molded on, or the, um, the reins that's already, the actual bit that's molded on the horse. I like the fact that this is actually kind of like some soft goods included. And the head is articulated fully, the neck as well. Um, I really like the body. I will say this, the weight of it, the legs don't hold up great, but once you kind of start to pose it and, and figure out how to do the weight distribution, it's just, it's fine. You just have to just kind of mess with it a little bit. The saddle comes off um, and it comes off because that's where you actually attach the stirrups in two little pegs. And um, it's kind of nice because it's adjustable. So then you, you, and I'll show you in a second, but you put the stirrups in, then you put the saddle on, and the stirrups back basically get locked in whatever length you need them to be. So that's nice too, and it's actually easily removable and, and easy to put back on. Um, as you can see, the legs, like I said, they're they're really articulated, so they kind of fold up fairly easy, easily. Um, it's kind of a warm day, though, so I kind of wonder if um, it was in my car, if the joints are also warmed up really good and loose. But here's the stirrups. There's two little pegs, like I said, underneath the saddle, and you can see the holes in the stirrups, so it makes it adjustable. You can make the stirrups longer or shorter, um, however you see fit with whatever figure you want to use. So I'm going to put it at the longest length, um, and you'll see why here in a minute. But yeah, look, they're really nice stirrups. You know, the paint on them, the, the paint on the whole thing is, looks really nice, but the browns on this, on this white, I just think look really, really good. And as you can see here, the peg, peg holes, and I'm gonna go ahead and put the stirrups in. And there's the saddle, of course. Like I said, nice brown. But there it is with the stirrups. Put in really nicely. Um, you can't even tell like that it that it's coming out of there. I think it just the whole thing is just such a fluid design. I think it looks really nice. And of course, you can see the reins and the bit. 
and how that all fits together well with the stirrups. So, um, the figure that I had with me at the time was Saber. Um, I just got her not too long ago, and I'll do a review of her too, probably. Um, you know, I, I the anime was cool, but I, I just really like the design of the figure, so I'm probably not going to collect all the figures, but I just thought this look, looked really cool on a horse. He didn't really see that. Um, and I, I also wanted to pair her up with um, uh, Thrall, because I just think that Thrall is actually undersized and as a, for a six inch figure. I think he was supposed to be much bigger, but I think he actually fits really well with Figma figures and SH Figure Arts figures because of the size. I think it's kind of cool. But back to the horse, I just think this whole thing looks really neat and it's fun. Um, you know, kind of like I thought of this like because an arch RPG, you know, medieval times RPG, and I have a, a Pokemon down there as just kind of a um, lichen rock, just to kind of show off how it how it fits with this horse, the sizes and everything, and. I'm just, I'm so excited about the possibilities. I haven't even started with this yet. This was one day, me being really excited, stopping, taking it out, finding a place I could kind of get into some some green, some woods, and, and show it off. But thumbs up to this, absolutely. I have the brown one coming in as well. I may not do a review, but I will definitely take pictures and get a video up as soon as possible. So hopefully you enjoyed this.